Okay, so I wanted to show y'all how I make my ground plant-based taco meat. You can refer to my other video on how to make the base for the plant-based ground beef. And um, this is just me showing you how I saute it up. So literally, I take my plant-based ground beef that I made and I saute it up. I put a little olive oil in the pan first. And then what I do is I add some taco seasoning. I try and use a taco seasoning that is, um, you know, organic, if I can find one. So I'll just add a little bit of the taco seasoning on there. And as you can see, it pretty much looks like ground beef. Um, it's pretty crumbly. So I just give it a little stir. Smelling like tacos. You wouldn't believe that it is completely meat free. No animals harmed in the making of this video. And then I add just a little bit of water just to help the seasoning stick to. Ooh. Stick to the mixture, not too much water because remember it is not real meat. Um, it will, you know, if you put too much water, it's just gonna oversaturate things. But just a little water, just to kind of help get our meat mixture coated. Not too much, I only like to pour a little bit. And it tastes really good, y'all. Like, my hubby, he's a tough food critic and he loves this. Like, I would make this for meat eaters any day and I know they wouldn't miss the meat at all. So we're trying to be more plant-based. We're not 100% plant-based, um, but we're going in that direction. And right now we're on a cleanse, a 10 day detox called the Shred 10. We're on day two. So I'm cooking this week, making sure that we stick to the guidelines, which is to avoid dairy and gluten. We're trying to avoid um, not too much processed foods, not too much processed sugars. And um, I take a plant-based supplement called Juice Plus. It's basically fruits and vegetables that they've dried down into a capsule. It just helps you get more fruits and veggies in on a daily basis. So this is this is what it looks like. I can see that. It looks pretty meaty actually and it tastes pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and just spoon this onto my tacos and that's it. I usually like to top my tacos with tomatoes and uh, a little bit of uh, arugula um, and also some red onions and I'm done so I hope y'all enjoy this video thanks for watching if you have any questions comments concerns you can go ahead and leave a comment below if you like this video feel free to give me a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos from me definitely subscribe because I plan on making a lot more of these videos all right y'all be blessed it's your girl Brittany Kiss I'm out.